Hello everyone, welcome back. D and we brothers, going quite well still. Uh, I'll be honest, I am, I am, truthfully still reeling about the loss of those couple of brothers. Sigma had no business dying there, <laughs> absolutely no business dying, and yet, and yet he found a way to die. Oh dear, right. Anyway though, we're not in too bad of a spot. We've got loads of food. Um, tools not looking too bad. We bought some more. Uh, money is okay. Eight days. Eight days worth. That's all right. Granted, we don't have... We only have eight brothers now, so the wages are not too expensive. Um, up here in the frozen plains, uh, Bullersby is where we are. And there are no contracts here, so we're going to have to leave. Obviously, we brought a trade caravan up. They had cheap food, which is where, where we bought the food from. But I think we need to leave now, because there's nothing really here for us anymore. Uh, yeah, we can't hire anybody. They're all expensive. So the only concerning... Well, not concerning. It is what it is. Is this a long old way back down to the next town? Now, there could be towns here. There could be towns here. But there's no indication. And we, you know, we could just be traveling not by road, so it'd be slower. And not find anything. However, I do notice there's a barracks here. And there's a little road sneaking through the swamp. So it's possible there's a city here. So I might check that. So, we're going to go we're going to go here at the very least. Down the road. Um we don't need to do anything else, do we? Everybody one day, oh, exposed ribs, 2 to 6 days. How bad is that? Okay, less hit points. Not the worst thing. He's in the back line. I said that last time uh with our pitchfork wielder and he immediately got sniped by throwing axes. But what's the chances of that happening twice in a row, right? <laughs> That's not going to happen. That's not going to happen. Oh, brigands, eight of them. Only eight of us, so I'm not too enthusiastic about that. Barbarians in those woods as well. Right then, let's... Oh, hello. Oh, we need a new ambition, of course. We we got friendly with a... With a um, faction, didn't we? We need to check that. So, I would love to have a battle standard, but that would cost 2,000 crowns. We definitely can't do that at the moment. Uh, again, get rid of a, a kind of random fortress location. Uh, arena fights, we're probably not going to be doing that yet. Um, I don't know if it really is that the towns in the south are the only ones that have the arenas anyway. But, um, yeah, we're not going to do that. I mean, in Mountain Blade, I love I love fighting in arenas. It's really fun. Um, and trading. Buy and sell 25 items of trading goods. Uh, we're probably not looking to do that. So I think we'll do the random location. You know, the, the random evil... Oh, there is a town here. Excellent. Let's check. No, 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 no. Go by the road. The swamp is very... Even on the road, it's slow. Muckenberg. How uh, how apt. Right on the edge of the forest. Okay. Have a weapons with a kennel. Dogs. Hmm. An armorer and a fletcher. Okay, how are we doing with the hiring? Quite a few WoW classes, which is very expensive. We do have... A rat catcher? Well. Well. A hunter of Skaven, if you will. He's also very cheap on the daily wage. Bow-legged and scrawny. <laughs> Let's give him a go. I'm not even going to check his traits. Let's just get him in. Let's have a looky. Oh, he comes with a net. I guess that's kind of self-explanatory. Rubbish armor, but we can give you good armor. So, hang on, is that even worth our time? I tell you what, he's nothing to write home about, is he? Four defense on both. Uh, okay attack, not bad. Um, unimpressive fatigue, but I guess it's not terrible. And his resolve isn't great. I mean, his initiative is very high, though. We've got to give him that. Should we leave him with the net, or should we give him a shield? I'm going to leave him with the net, I think. I mean, he's a rat catcher. We can't take that away from him. I think we will give him the armor. It's a little bit risky, but we will try and keep him alive. What do we want to do for a weapon? We could give him something like a spear to try and keep people away. Who have I given the throwing, the javelins? 46, 42. I'm tempted to give him the javelins, you know. Because he doesn't have a... Yeah, I think I will. Because he doesn't have a shield... I might give him the javelins so he can at least try and, you know, he can net people and throw javelins at them before they get to him. 
I think that's a good idea. Um, okay, so what do we want to give him? I mean, we could give him a two-handed axe instead, but I don't think that's a good idea. A bludgeon. Uh, obviously comes with a stun. The pickaxe is good against armor. 15 to 30, though. The bludgeon is 20 to 35. 20 to 35 on the cleaver. Obviously, the knife, we can potentially bypass armor, but it's... Oh, we do have... No, that's a spear. We do have the spear, which does give him spear wall. I'm tempted by the spear, you know. I think we will. We'll give him the spear for now. Um, if we had a nice dagger, I might give it to him, but this knife is not great. And we didn't buy the nice dagger. So we're going to leave him with that for now. Put him on the edge, and we'll see how he goes. He's probably dead. Old Bert win. <laughs> okay. What have you got in the old marketplace? Let's take a look at the prices. Not too bad on the food. We don't really need food, though. So I think we won't buy any food. Um, tools, not too bad. Not massive. But then again, we have no. We don't really have much money, so this is kind of out of the question. You have a war dock here. It costs 432, though, which is a bit naughty. Quiver of bolts. They've got a few weapons. And shields and a couple of armor pieces, so it's quite a nice shop. Oh, we can't do the contract. Just realized that's kind of sucky. How much are the dogs? The dogs you put in your accessory slot and then you release them when you want to. Now, as far as I'm aware, when they die, it's gone, I think. So that's worth, you know, it's, it's a bit of an investment. Now, obviously, these are cheaper than what they're worth, but... I mean, we'd still have about four days worth of wages. Or we could get one of the cheaper ones. How do you know how powerful they are? War dog, and these are war hounds. And what's that? That's also a war dog. Tell you what, we're going to buy... We're going to buy Misty, then. We're going to go for it. Why not? What's the difference? How do we know? I mean, this is a northern hound, whereas that's just a hound. But what? What is there any point in not buying the cheapest one? Uh, who do we want to give the dog to? We could also give him the dog. <laughs> Rat catcher, <laughs> dog unleasher. We could give the farmer the dog. I say the farmer. He was a beggar. But because he's got a pitchfork, I'm labelling him a farmer. <laughs> I think maybe we will give you the dog. And then if you get in trouble, you can unleash it. But yeah, there's no there's no stat line for the dog. So is there any point? Maybe they, he costs less AP or something? To use? I don't know. It's a tough one. But anyway, we'll see how that goes. So we can't do any contracts here. And it's pretty much a dead end. So I guess we better go back to Kalkborg immediately. Because we do need some work. We definitely need some work. I mean, I wouldn't mind a couple more bodies as well. But it's not the end of the world. Could definitely do maybe I should have I don't really uh see bows are expensive. I could have bought a bow for uh what's his name? I've forgotten his name. Oh yes, Markov. I could have bought a bow for him, that would be better, or a crossbow, but they're pretty expensive. So I don't really want to do that. Okay. We can't do a contract here either. These guys are these guys are jerks. These guys are real jerks. A uh, temple. How long? One to five days. Oh, we don't really have enough. We don't really have spare money. So we shouldn't really even be here because I can't really afford anything at the moment. Um, we just need to find a contract. But look at this. That town's really far. There is a road leading up here. Let's take our chances. We need to explore, right? Let's see if we can find another town. I am on speed too. <laughs> oh, here we go. An iron vein. Oh, along the road. You find a kid wearing a rather opulent chain around his neck. It's so heavy his head is bent forward, but that minor struggle doesn't wipe the mile-wide grin off his face. Markov pushes the kid down and takes the necklace. Where'd you get this? The kid cries out, trying to grab his treasure back, but he's about three feet and a good jump too short. Hey, that's mine. Give it back. Another kid comes over flashing a ring so large it's pinching two fingers at once. All right. That's enough. The company fans out and eventually find a dead merchant in some tall grass beside the tree line. 
His face is purpled and jagged with broken bones. It appears he's been stoned to death. A group of about 40 or 50 youngsters appear from the tree line, each juggling a stone in their hand. Their leader, a little runt with red hair and sleeves of tattoos, asks what you want. You tell him you'll be taking the merchant's goods. The leader laughs. Oi, is that so? I'll give you 10 seconds to rethink that choice. Oi, that I will, mister. Are we going to be able to fight 50 kids? We are mercenaries. But we also have a paladin. <laughs> Should we try and make it big? I'm worried, though. Are they all going to start cobbing stones at us? We'll die, right? I think... I think we should leave it. Let's... let's. Oh, I kind of want to see what happens, though. Hmm. Like, literally, we could do this, all die, and that's the end of the run. You know what? Screw it. We're taking the goods. Nice. We seem to have managed it. <laughs> uh, despite the miniature military force arrayed before you, the goods are ordered to be taken. The little tyke in charge of the operation screams a war cry, more dying cat than diving hawk. Take them down! Throw! 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 <laughs> that was not worth the, the damage to my throat. <laughs> On his command, the mob of children start hurling stones from the tree line. The cell swords band together, holding up shields in formation akin to a tortoise, and slowly move forward. It's a strange effort, like a shell game artist sliding his cup over the ball, but the company manages to grab the merchant's good and slide away out of the field, all while being pelted from every which way. The little leader kid shakes his fist at you. You give him the finger and start back onto the path where you take a good look at the merchant's goods. Geralt stares at the rewards while rubbing a welt on his forehead. God damn, man. I've seen armies not nearly so fierce. I weep for the future men who have to cross swords with these lads and lasses. Right. We gain a signet ring. 154 crowns. <laughs> Wasn't great. And Bertwin suffers a ripped ear. Those little bastards really gave it to us. Oh, Bertwin, what's the deal? Oh, of course you've... The my poor rat catcher. What's the deal? What's the deal? Okay. Not the end of the day. End of the day? End of the world? Minus 15% initiative for one to three days. And obviously that will cost us some medical. Right. So we can just sell the ring. That's all it is. We might sell this token as well. We'll see. Anyway, that drama aside. Thank God, a contract. Right, there is a weaponsmith. Local holiday. Time for food and drink. All right. Obviously, oh God, no. Very expensive people here. There's quite a few. Maybe there is too many WoW classes being spawned. I don't know. Maybe that's just chance. Seems like quite a few, but we'll see. We'll see. Right, how much would the ring... We can literally sell it for slightly over what it's worth. I think I'll hold on to it until either we get desperate or we find a better deal. Food is a slightly good deal. We don't really need food at the moment, though. Um, ammo is expensive. Tools are okay. About the right price. But hey, why am I even looking? Because we don't, we don't really want to buy anything now, do we? We could buy another shield. But... Nah. Nah, because we're going to run out of money, aren't we? Let's do the contract. or see what it is. Okay, important delivery. Two days east. Oh, we can do that. I bet it's not much money, though. Oh, not bad. Okay. Eight crowns per head. Up to 15. Well, that's fine. We don't have 15. Another 500 with the job's done. Um, We need more payment once the work is done. Oh, 660. Nice. <laughs> it's always worth haggling. Okay. Oh, it is a caravan, not a delivery. Okay. Let's do it. Why not? Was there, a, like, a road... Ah, no. Pause, pause. <laughs> oh, there is a road leading leading west, so potentially there is another town that way. How close to the edge of the... Oh, God, no. <laughs> We're nowhere near the edge of the map. Okie doke. I wouldn't mind getting ambushed here. Purely if we can... Uh... You know, Gold Hearts Company. Don't tell me... You know, okay, good. <laughs> as long as it's something we can defeat. Now, Bullersby is indeed the way north town. So, oh, barbarians. Are we going to get involved? No. We seem to have some military actually guarding the route. So... Okay. So, yeah, it does take us all the way back up north. But it's not bad money. Not bad at all. It's literally like six days wages for like two days, 
two days going, and obviously we're healing as well. We will check in at the town. Nobody to hire. Wow. You do have a contract, though. Oh my goodness, it's all happening. Terrified villagers. Uh, raided. Recently been raided. They're trying to rebuild, and they're well supplied at least, because we brought the caravan. Um, ooh. A, sp a speetum? A spetum? Never, ever heard of that. Does good damage, though. We still need to be on the lookout for a two-handed mace for our for our paladin. Okay, right, what's the contract? Grave robbers are plundering the cemetery. All payment once the work is done. Nice. <laughs> so the only the only slight worry to oh it's the tomb of the old kings. My only slight worry is um It's going to be bloody undead, isn't it? How many men have we got? Nine. Are we going to be okay? Hopefully. How are you? Are you going to heal? I guess it is only hit points. Um, hopefully we'll be okay. We'll be okay. Um, I mean, the P Siegfried should be able to carry a bit. We do have the dog. We got the javelins to help out. Let's um, Let's go for it. We'll be all right. We'll be all right, guys. Oh yeah, I meant to have a quick look at the old, uh, not camp, not camp, retinue. What is our uh, 224? So at 250, I'm not sure if it costs money, but we can finally hire a, um, a companion as it were. Good stuff. Right, let's go over there then. Okay, you eye a tombstone with a mound of soil unearthed at its base. Lots of mud lead away like a crumb trail. There are no shovels. No men. As you follow the lead, you come across a band of undead moaning and groaning, now staring at you with insatiable hunger. Well, what a surprise. <laughs> right, two arms. Two arms, men. You can't make out who you'll be facing. Oh, dear. Okay, well, we can always retreat, yeah. Well, potentially we can retreat. Oh, my goodness. There's graves everywhere. Look at this map. There's seven of them. These are just zombies, though. Vida gangers. Oh my goodness. There's quite a lot of graves um, and obstacles. Let's just put on the old um, overlay. Yeah, I mean, that probably... I mean, it... Do these kind of... Okay, no, look. The tree blocks sight, but these ones don't. That does, but the lower ones don't. So at least maybe that's going to... Then again, they can walk over some of these. I'm thinking my ranged weapons will have a bit of an advantage is where I'm coming from, but we'll see. Right, come on, lads. Um, what are we doing? You obviously can't reach. You're ready with your javelin and your net, but yeah, we're not going to be able to do anything. So, of course, you've got the warhound. Okay, we won't be doing that because if it charges in and dies, I feel like we've just wasted our money. So let's let's end everybody's turn. Because we're not going to do anything here. We're going to let them come. Okay. Hopefully there's not like a necromancer or something behind it, behind them all. That would be disappointing. No. Uh, seven zombies. Yeah. Okay. All right. We can do this. Hopefully. Yeah. Right. Let's start our assault. 20% chance. Well. Ah! Oh, look at that. Beautiful. You can't reach yet. So hold on. Can you? Yep. Nice. Reload. I mean, if we don't... If we don't have to use the dog, I suppose we won't. Or at least we'll leave it until the end. Oh, we do have Holy Light, of course. Excellent. Costs 25 fatigue and he only has 60. We've got to get that up. We have got to. Got to get his fatigue up. All right, gents. This is where it gets interesting. Go on behind the tree. Hopefully you can get a javelin out there. Speak of the devil. 57%. No! Should I throw another one? It does mean he doesn't have his spear out. I think we will, though. Oh, no! Okay. It is what it is. You can't reach. 
seven percent. This bloody thing's in the way of you. Six, five, uh, five. Wow. Okay. Well, maybe if we go for you, we might hit your friend here. Twenty percent there, but I'm actually gonna take this and just see. Oh, nearly. Ah, oh, shame. Do we want to shield wall? No. Good hit. We could step forward, but I don't think we will. At least not yet. You've got adrenaline. Need to remember that. It might be worth you going forward. Is it, though? I think it is, actually. Like, they have the movement blocked there, so it's not like you can be very easily surrounded, and then we can step up. Let's, let's, um... 2 AP, because it's only light snow. Yeah, let's step up and go for a just a normal overhead strike. Yeah, because we're not going to split. That's a stab, and then we've got swing that we don't want. Yeah, so let's just do a normal... Beautiful, that's what I hope for. This one might be able to attack you. Might have enough AP. Hopefully you don't. Oh, they've both got in there. Okie doke, right. Tell you what I think we'll do with you, sir. Move you in here. Excellent. Oh, he's very low. Good. Should we use adrenaline? I think we will. You don't have a shield, do you? Like, I'm finding it hard to see, <laughs> but you don't, do you? Just wondering if Lash would be better. I assume not. Oh, he's very low. Okay, we better swap you. Now, because he doesn't have a trait for it, this does cost action points. Um, and we haven't used the net, unfortunately. That is the price, but can we try and kill this one? Okay, at least you won't take damage from two places. I think we'll go here. Maybe hit him. Nope. <laughs> okay. Should we... Let's... Oh, you would be a little bit surrounded. No, I think we'll wait with you. Okay, excellent. Bit worried about um, Bertwin here. We're going to have to hope luck is on our side. Okay. It is on our side, at least at the moment. <laughs> Rarely lasts. We could hit there, but no, let's... Oh, that sucks. Okay. Right then. Obviously, a round swing doesn't help. Oh, dear. Could have used adrenaline again, actually. Um, come on. Dab. Oh, come on. It's 82%. Come on, dude. Um... Good. Should we let the dog out now? I think we will, actually. And hopefully... That it won't get one shot. Oh, it nearly killed that one. Step up into there. Oh, if only we can attack once more. Good. Okay, thankfully he didn't go for the doggo. He missed. Excellent, excellent. Right, can we get a kill? No. Siegfried letting the side down. Oh, no! Zombies are raising! Oh, my goodness. They even pushed me out of the way. I forgot they could do that. So if they raise underneath you, you get shoved over a tile, which is really bad. Okay, good, good. And then can you... Okay, good. Right, we've regained control of the situation.
Oh. Oh, come on. He's on like no HP. Don't do that to me. We use adrenaline. Maybe the stone can get this guy. Come on. Oh, fatigue. Can't fire. Okay. Nice dodge. Okay. Good. We move up. Let's move up. Okay. Excellent. We didn't take any damage. That couldn't have gone better. We got a bunch of kills. Nobody leveled up. Because I guess they're not really worth a lot of XP. No. Like, Siegfried got two kills and it was only worth 65 XP. But look at that. Volker turning up. A lot of damage. Everybody turned up. Good stuff. Good stuff. Okay. We get another token. And a few weapons. Granted, most of them suck. And 125 crowns. That's not bad. Um, let's go back then. Get paid. Not bad for a day's work at all. Quite happy with that, actually. No longer terrified villagers. I mean, there are... How long would it take zombies to come over here? But anyway. Well, I suppose it was brigands, supposedly. Right. I don't... There are no contracts, so we won't even bother waiting for morning to shop or anything. I suppose, then, we're going to go all the way back to Kalkborg. I think that probably makes sense. And then we may even come back down to our original location. But either way, let's go Kalkborg. Um, what's our relationship like? Who did we get it up with, then? Was it Bola? These guys. Vedelmark. Bola's B. Uh, I guess it was Vedelmark that we got friendly with. Okay. Okie doke, come on down. Day 10 already. Are they going to engage? I'm going for it. <laughs> they didn't engage. I'm not sure how strong barbarians are. We're going to find out. They sound a little bit spooky. They have a reaver. That guy. They look kind of badly equipped, but they have naughty scary tribal kind of armor on, which is a bit spooky. Can we fire? Of course not. We are one tile out of range, as is tradition. Okie doke. Uh, oh, we should have got your javelins ready again. My bad. Damn. <laughs> it would be your turn right then, wouldn't it? Oh, and he's out of sight because of the tree. What a cheeky bugger. Oh, hello. Is this the strat? You, you're swarming Bertwin. Do you hate him? You obviously do. Okay. Well, then, we'll probably move one over here. Maybe two? Let's move two. And then we've always got the dog if we get in the... I mean, I've made this mistake before. <laughs> Coming too close to the flank with my, uh, my guy. But he doesn't seem to have his wound anymore. I didn't check, because I'm an idiot. Um... Should we step up one? No, I think we'll wait. I might step you up. Yeah, let's step you up. Adrenaline, okay. And you as well. You've got throwing axes and javelins. Ah, sugar. I've just noticed. Oh, thank God he missed. What about you? Oh, oh that's very scary. Damn, now we can't. Oh, he's got hit as well. Okay. What a bad hit chance. Let's go for the back one and we might hit something. Maybe that logic is not perfect. Um, oh, goodness. Do I want to... Netting doesn't really help me here because they're using ranged weapons anyway. Bugger. Look at his armor. It's trashed. Go for a stab then, my friend. Can't really help you. That's the Reaver as well. We'll go for the one with the ranged weapon. And we're going to charge in with everybody, I think. Ooh, not going to be given the opportunity. 
No, here they come. Okay, he misses. We've got to get working on the Reaver. Granted, it's harder to hit him. Should we get the dog out? I might, you know. I think we will. I want to try and... Okay, nice. He's wavering. That's a nice little bonus there. Good. Do we want to push you out this way? I think we do. It's a bit spooky, but I think we will. I think we'll go out and then we'll adrenaline. don't really want you to be surrounded, so we'll do that. He is actually wavering, which is good. Should we heal? How much? How many AP? 4 AP. That's awkward because hitting is 6. Let's heal him. It's a bit spooky how it's like an attack. Nice. Okay. Nice little heal. We'll see if that works out. We can actually heal twice, but it's a lot of fatigue. Should we do it anyway? Let's, let's top him up. Oh, I love that sound. That's really nostalgic for me. Now, they've both used adrenaline. Um, not great because they're about to smash him to bits after all that. Right then. Oh, excellent. Oh. 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 oh okay, okay. Not dead yet. It's not looking good. Oh, no, it's his turn. Oh, he's dead. Oh, my rat catcher. What a swine they are. A group of swine. Come on, let's... um. Oh dear. Oh dear. Okay, right, we get you. Oh, you little sod. Nice. Primarily because he probably would have just slaughtered the dog. Oh, I can't believe we lost the rat catcher. Okay, good, right, we're, we're closing in on them now. Are you going to be okay fatigue-wise? Yes. Oh, you've missed. Oh, and you've missed. Come on, doggo. Get it done. Okay. Um, What's the best way of doing this? If I go there, do I get... Yeah. No danger of hitting my pals. Oh, okay. Going after Siegfried, you cheeky bugger. 54%. We get it. Oh, I tell you what. Gurnot is fuming, isn't he? Oh, nothing's... God, we've got to repair that bloody armor now, but I won't complain. Could be much worse. He's fleeing. Okay, good. Let's get surrounding as much as we can. It's a little bit awkward, isn't it? Now run him down. Hopefully he won't manage to escape. Excellent. Right. Oh, Bertwin. Oh, we gave him decent armor as well. Bugger. Everybody else is okay. Some light wounds. Healed by tomorrow. All of them, which is good. Uh, we've got a couple of level ups. Gurnot, who's absolutely slaying right now. And Volker gets one as well. An axe hammer. God, it sucks. <laughs> well, no, actually. Look. 200% effective against armor is very interesting. Very interesting. We also get a couple of throne... Oh, three sets of throne weapons. That's very, very lucrative. I think we'll probably use those and, and screw up our management, as we've done so far. Um, I, it's actually, to be fair, one of those will be the one we already had, I presume. But yeah, now we can give... Let's just organize ourselves. Um, we can give everybody a little set of throne weapons. Does reduce our fatigue, but and obviously it kind of means we're going to be using more ammunition if we do use them. And some of these aren't even full right now. But I tell you what, it's not bad. Um, just checking, nobody. Twenty to forty-five. Where's that blunt thing? Twenty to thirty. Nah, no, I don't think we'll use that for now. Okie doke. Let's level up then. 
Oh my goodness, that resolve. We're definitely taking resolve. Health, not a bad option. And maybe attack. You do need to get your defense up, but maybe we just keep you as kind of a lancer at the back forever. I might even give you fatigue or damage. Be a bit risque. That's not very good health, though. No, let's give you health and damage. Perk-wise, then. Crippling strikes. Um... Or maybe adrenaline's quite good on you as well. I mean, everything's good, right? I kind of like crippling strikes. More likely to cause injuries from the back line. Let's do that. As for you, sir, Volker. Health is probably almost always on the menu. In fact, I can already... Mm, maybe Defense isn't bad, though. 63. I might actually go resolve defense attack. And by might, I mean I just did it. Um, I could pick up Colossus, but we can go down to the second line. Executioner. Extra damage against people that have had injuries. Um, it would make sense to put you a bit closer to Gurnot for a little bit of a combo. Bullseye is not really... Dodge is good. However, it takes your initiative to gain the extra, and you don't really have very high initiative. Um, fortified Mind is Resolve. Resilient, uh, yeah, bleeding, etc. Has its uh, turn time reduced. Seal brow. No longer critted when hit in the head. Quick hands, we don't really need. Gifted, no, we don't really need that. Um, I think I'll go executioner with you. It's kind of thematic. And then what I'm going to do is I'm going to swap you two over. And then hopefully we can get a bit of combo going here where Gurnot is more likely to cause injuries and our Executioner does extra damage if you've sustained an injury. Good show. Right, let's go. Screw Muckenberg. Let's go to Kalkborg. We have a reasonable amount of money, so we can get some more brothers. Not too worried. Let's see what is available. Okay, then we've got the train. It'd be nice that we don't have a contract here. That's annoying. It'd be nice to use the training hall. You know, you literally just pay for for fights that give you a level up. Well, extra experience gain, I should say, for the coming battles. But I'm not really sure we have the disposable income for that. Not at the moment. We have got an armor and a weaponsmith and a temple, which we don't need, which is good news. Um, the ammo is not going to last forever. We do need some brothers. Not that expensive, though. Um, ooh, okay. Do we want to do the 341? Possibly. A wild man. Goswin, I think, is on the cards. I think we'll just pick him up. I just hit higher twice. <laughs> I don't know why. I just double-clicked. So the long and short of it is, we've ended up with the 341. Markwood. I was probably going to get him, but I was tempted to check his traits first. Looks like he has a few. But anyway, Goswin, Apprentice, comes with nothing. Now, he does have an affinity for defense. He's got quite good initiative. The fatigue is not terrible. The health is not terrible. So, you know what? That's okay. I might try and get him a better shield from the marketplace rather than give him that. I'm tempted to give him the, the Act Hammer just for a laugh. And maybe that hat. Um... Yeah. Okay. And you, wild man, tree limb, 25 to 40. Why would you ever want to use this? It's not that good. Maximum fatigue, minus 20. Well, anyway, well, let's have a look. Wild man, minus 15% experience gain. That sucks. Impatient, always acts first in the very first round. Well, that's not really that helpful. Oh, maybe it is. Superstitious. Minus 10 resolve for fear, panic, and mind control. Okay, so it's not great at the moment, if I'm honest. Him going first on every first turn is rather interesting. Because it gives me a temptation to give him a ranged weapon. Especially since he has this. But I'm not really sure. The problem is, is they're never in range on the first turn. Well, almost never. Maybe if there's a way to get his vision up. Which there might be. But anyway, I think he needs to be ranged, right? Don't you think? 
going to be something like this. But that does mean we've got to get him a ranged weapon, of course. Right, we'll see if we can get you a better... Sh well, let's have a look at the marketplace. You've got 20 armor, you've got 20 armor. We don't have anything more exciting than that. Don't have a lot of armor, actually. Okay, let's have a look at the marketplace. And the armorer, I suppose. No, don't want any. We do need tools, but 250 is not good. Ammo, not good at all. What do we got? We could buy a bow. It's not that bad. 188 and 44 for the uh, the arrows. Should we get him a bow? I think we will. Well, I'm not even really going to think about it much. Let's sort that out so I know what we're doing. Give him a knife. You guys got a knife? No, you should have a knife. Yeah. You. I mean, we could give you a knife as well, but nah, that's fine. You just have less chance to hit with this. That's the problem. But I still think I'm, I'm happy with it. Okay, so that's you. You do need some head armor. Well, let's see what, what's available. And then we do need a, a decent shield, maybe. 125. Probably check the armor and the weaponsmith. Oh, very nice. I would love to have that pike. Two-handed flail. Pole hammer. Oof. Oof. That's what we need for our main man. Reasonably priced caps here as well. 88. 125 for the shield. These shields are more expensive, so... That's that out the window. Weaponsmith, what have you got? Very expensive items. A holy staff. Goodness. Frost staff. I think those are probably to do with WoW. Thinking about it, holy spell power and whatnot for the priest and, and frost for a mage or something. Two-handed maze. Give it here. Um, a rondel dagger. Wow. Only rogues know how to use it. Okay, so it's for dual wielding. That's very spicy, isn't it? I see, and then that's the standard dagger. But anyway, all of these are rather expensive. 282, yeah, it's kind of too much for a good dagger. So we're not doing anything. Let's grab a couple of caps. Maybe all three. No, money's not that good, especially since I want a shield. That's probably going to do it because we are not rolling in money. Now we could... Oh, I should check how much that ring sells for, shouldn't I? I would like to get you some better... Um, Give you... Uh, hang on. What, who's got what? Is anyone... You haven't got... Yeah, no. Sod that. Give you that. 40 there. Okay, that's fine. Weapon-wise, then. Should we give you that? We have to repair it, but I kind of just want to use it. It's an axe hammer. <laughs> it's so good against armor. Let's, let's go for it. Sod it. Sod it. Let's go for it. Okay. So, my only concern is that you only have 20 armor. Has anybody got something better in the back line? Yeah, you don't need that. Let's be real. Now, it's probably going to get lost because he's going to die. But let's give him a chance. Alright? Let's give him a chance, Goswin, of making something happen. Okay. Do we want the archer at the side? Or Markolf? I guess the... Yeah, no, nah, it's fine. Actually, no, it's not. I prefer Markolf at the side. He can fire twice with stones if people are over here. I like it better. Morale is not great, actually, look. Everybody is only content because Bertwin, Sigmar, and Wenzel all died. We did lose some brothers. Okie doke. Right, how are we doing with the, um, the ring? 290. I think we can do better. Maybe I'm wrong. The tokens, I'm, I'm tempted to sell if we need to. We're not going to be crafting, you know those tier sets anytime soon. We're not going to get anywhere near the worth for them. Okay, that's it then, isn't it? We're not going to buy anything. We've got seven days of food. We are going to use some of the tools. Ammo's not great, but it's way too expensive. It's almost double price. We have three days worth of wages. 
then we're probably not going to buy... Wait, was there even a tavern? No, it's a training hall. I was going to say we're not going to buy a drink, but they don't have a tavern. Right, should we go south? Is there any roads shooting off anywhere else? No. Let's go back home to our, our, our lovely Vedelmark. Let's get out of these horrible northern lands. Trading caravan. See, we could attack trading caravans, but that uh, doesn't sound very paladin-ish. And also, I really don't want to make towns hostile for, towards me because, you know, I'm a big noob. We might do a deserter run-through at some point. That'll be really fun. Okay. Tavern, Barber, Fletcher, and a temple. Right, but most importantly, a contract. Um, ba -ba 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 -ba. Caravan guarded to Salzburg. Southwest. Well, we haven't explored Southwest. How much? 930. That's very nice. I still want more, though. All right, fine. 16 crowns per head as well. Let's do this. Now, it is three days. So, on that basis, we're not going to have... Uh, well, we should have enough money just to get there. Right? Just. Should I sell a couple of things? The ring, 306. We are getting good value for it. Sod it. Let's sell it. We'll sell it at our, our nice hometown. It'll give them a little economic boost. Ammo isn't too expensive here. I might buy some. We just sold that for 300. Let's spend 100 on some on some ammo. Cuz we're not in the best spot there. Okay. Good show. Let's um let's escort a caravan. South. You notice the mutt a few miles back and a few miles forward he's still there bobbing and slinking in and out of sight. A mongrel such as he doesn't follow a band of dangerous men for no reason. Maybe someone is feeding it. Company needs a mascot. Take it in. Nice. You decide to take a chunk of meat and approach the dog. It is skittish at first, backing away on your approach, but the aroma you have in hand is as alluring one, to be sure. An alluring one, sorry. The mongrel slinks back towards you, pausing here and there, eyes flicking in search of an ambush. You can see a barrel of ribs on the dog. Many days on the road, having given the pup a gaunt frame. Its ears are stitched up and its tail bolted with the signs of battle. This here animal knows how to fight, and that's just what it'll be doing for you from now on. Okay, hold on then. Also, I thought this was southwest. It is. How do we go south? Isn't that literally southwest, but we're going this way? I've been swindled. How are we going to get there? Literally. Salzbruch. I don't see any other roads going southwest, unless you're going to take us all the way up there, but then that's very much northwest. I guess what I'm saying is I am intrigued where we're going. <laughs> anyway, we have a doggo. An extra doggo. It's called Battle Brother for some reason. We can't rename the dogs either. That's a shame. That's a shame. So we have a doggo here. I'll tell you what, we could give him a doggo as well. No, it'd be too expensive because you sling two stones a turn. That's awkward, actually. We don't really have a good person to give it to. Do we? Your melee defense isn't that high, and I want to keep you alive. We've got a dog on this flank and a dog on this flank. I think we'll do that. Nice, though. Free dog. wonder if that increases our food. It might do. It doesn't say it uses provisions. Right, let's find out where we're going. This is southwest, apparently. No wonder it's a three-day journey, then. Salzburg probably isn't that far away. But we've got to do a giant loop to get there. At least I hope it's not going to take longer than three days. And it would be three days in a straight line. I hope that's not what it means. Or maybe they meant southeast. Maybe it's a bug and it means southeast. Because this doesn't make any sense. We are turning back. Brigands there. Don't think they dare come in. I mean, we do have ten dudes. We have ten brothers. It looks like it is southwest. <laughs> oh, goodness. Well, at least we're exploring, right? But goodness, what a long way.
<laughs> Burn wall, okay. <laughs> Look at all this exploration. There's got to be a better road for you to take, surely. I guess you can't leave the road with a caravan at all. I guess that's the problem. Because you, they can't cut across. Obviously, those brigands want nothing to do with us. Neither do they. Grandview Pastures. Yep, thought not, mate. Hopefully, this is it. It is. Okay. Well, that really was three days. Might try and get those brigands. It is night time. Contract. Okay. Okay, bring property back from brigands. 610? Need more. Okay, 610. Alright, alright, fine. Um, demonic statuette. I think we'll do that. Um, oh, we can go in the tavern. Let's definitely spend 49 crowns and, and try and raise our morale. Now, I might just chase down these brigands first immediately. Yeah. Oh, a poacher. They've got a bow. Oh, it looks like I have men helping me. Were there local guards? Oh, there was. There were... Oh, it's a caravan. We're not still with the caravan, but I guess they're close enough. Now, this is very awkward terrain, isn't it? Very, very awkward terrain. I'm going to move up. <laughs> worth a go. I feel like we've got to move up because otherwise it's just going to be horrible. Nice. One of those gentlemen. I mean, it's not going to be great anyway. Come on, please let my guys go before that lot. Not looking good. As long as we can get in front, it's not terrible. Ugh, you're going to be in a little pit there. Oh, hello. In that case, move over there. Oh no, but that's down in the... Oh, sugar. This could be very messy. Let's adrenaline. Oh no, he's got in there. That's where I wanted to be. Oh, you've got javelins out. Oh crap, of course you do. And now you can't slash. Oh dear. Oh, Goswin, I'm scared. Goswin, I don't feel so good. Okay, let's um, scrap the ranged weapons. Where's the poacher? There. Ingolf, get that. Get, 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 get. Doesn't mean we can't, we can't attack. We've paid the price for having the ranged weapons out. What a horrible map. We are in the mountains. This is kind of what you get, isn't it? Right, we're going to have to go in there. But at least it's our, our paladin. You know, he's got a fair bit of armor. He's at a disadvantage, but he's got armor. The trade caravan guards are doing nothing. Right then. We'll take the chance to hit. Adrenaline. Bloody hell. Okay. Um. Oh, you need to reload. 50... Seven. Okay, we'll take we'll take the fifty then. Nice, good kill. That's important. Anyone we can get rid of. Oh, you've got an enemy right in front of you. I guess it means it's knife time. Good job we gave you that knife. Should we let's put the dog? But I'm gonna put him behind so he takes him a little bit longer to. No, never mind. He got there and now he's being. Oh, he did hit. We might lose that dog. I don't know. Um, let's let's help him. I know we've got a poacher there. We're going to try and lash over the shield. No. Okay. Oh, no, 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 Goswin. <laughs> Secret in that little hole. We've got to get a kill here. Somehow. Find a way. You're not finding a way. Okay, good. Caravan hands starting to come up. Oh no, 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 Gerald, no. Would be bloody night time, wouldn't it? 
17 percent or we'll go here oh nice okay oh no 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 Oh, this is going to be a very costly battle. All because of the terrain. Maybe I should have moved back. I couldn't move back, though. Like, maybe I should have just stayed in a line, even at the terrain disadvantage. But goodness, it's terrible. Oh, Goswin. Don't die. Split shield. That's no good to us. Uh, you do have a dog. Dog it up. And then hit this one. Oh, bugger. Are you bleeding? You are bleeding. Sugar. Oh, thank God. Okay. Oh, the double kill. Okay, we're going to heal. Who needs it? Hang on. Who needs it the most? You're on 44. You're on 19. Ugh. You're on 58. We've got a heal here. There could be two attacking you. Uh, who's more valuable? We can only do one more heal. Oh, they're both fleeing, actually. They're both fleeing. In that case, we're going to step up on the poacher. And hopefully won't get punished for it. We might. Um... Come on, doggos. Oh, that's a bad miss. This guy is not fleeing. We've got to bear that in mind. Oh, I didn't. I forgot you were you're double bleeding. Oh crap! We've really got to heal you. We don't have the bandage available. I don't think. Oh my goodness! Can't really do much here. I mean, we won't hit any of our own men. Nice. Come on, caravan guard, step up. Help me out. Do something. I don't know what you're gonna do, but just do something. Damn it. No. No. 10% chance. We'll go for the back one. <laughs> yes, and we hit him. Perfect. I can't even tell who's who right now. Good hit. Flash. Headshot. Okay. Nice. Okay, this is the last one. Right, heal. Heal. He's bleeding heavily. You can only heal once. You don't have the fatigue. This should be okay. Exposed ribs. Double bleeding. Goodness. Goodness gracious. Okay. Just sit tight. Just don't do anything. Just... God, that's a lot of bleeding. I think the bleeding just goes away at the end of the battle. It is the end. Goodness gracious. Oh, Markov. Yeah, okay. Exposed ribs. That was a very dangerous. We ended up not losing anybody. Thank goodness. We didn't lose a dog either. But hell, that was, that was nearly a disaster. But in the end, we actually got four level ups. <laughs> so it's not worked out too badly. But we've probably got a lot of armor to repair and, and whatnot. We get a bit of money. We get a bit of food. We get some ammo. Another quiver. And a few weapons. Another bow, actually. Does that mean, then? I think that does mean... Uh, we have to pay for ammo. But is it time to upgrade Markov to a bow? 25 to 40 on that. I might leave it for now. I might leave it purely well not purely but a lot because i guess it's not that much ammo no we better give him the bow we we literally don't have to spend any money we do have to repair it but it's not and we have to restock that by three arrows but it's not terrible okay can we talk about your morale suffered an injury okay well we won the battle though you should be happy should be happy. Okay, we didn't lose any armor, did we? We'll put the ranged weapons back in and hope for better fortunes going forward. Okay, right. Let's do some level ups. Edelmar. Oh, excellent. 
Excellent. And I think we'll probably go... We Range defense wouldn't be terrible, but maybe initiative... Fatigue hasn't really been a problem yet. We'll go we'll go initiative to get him in there early and get resolve as well. Because resolve can be an absolute killer. Right. Shall we take bullseye? When you don't have a clear line of fire, the penalty is reduced to 50%. I think we might take that. Um Yeah, let's take bullseye. Okie doke. Siegfried, level up, sir. We absolutely need your fatigue up. It looks high, but because of the because of all the heavy armor and stuff, it is not. Um, health is not a good roll. Resolve is a good thing to get up. Initiative's good. I'm tempted to get defense, though. Let's get melee defense, I think. Even though it's only a plus three. Plus five is a very good roll, though. No, let's get some defense and some attack. Right then, perk-wise, this is interesting now. We can keep the, on the same row and get Blessing of Might. But Holy Power... This enhances your Holy Light skill. Okay, it increases the healing and reduces the fatigue. Very interesting. We have Cleanse. Oh, remove bleeding. Well, that would have been good to have last battle. Anticipation. Melee defense. Oh, that's nice. Hammer of justice. So we can stun someone. Divine strength. Melee skill. But oh my goodness. Some of these are great. I think we'll probably take cleanse though. Yeah. We can get rid of bleeding. Right? Just by healing. I think that's really good. Okay. Ingolf. Hmm. Hmm. Obviously, defense would be good. It is plus three, so I think we'll probably take that. And then maybe resolve and health, I think, will go. We'll take the plus fours. I love that sound, by the way, the dice sound. Okay, you took Colossus. I'm tempted to take uh, Steel Brow. Hits to the head. Make you a real tanky boy. Oh, quick hands. Oh, quick hands is so good though, isn't it? Oh, no, I think we'll take quick hands. So that we can swap between our, our ranged weapon for, for free. God, some of these skills would have been so useful last time. And I think we'll do the same thing for you, Geralt. I think we'll take quick hands for you as well. I think that's really good. Right then. Oh, your attack's quite nice, isn't it? Resolve is not good, but we've rolled plus two. I really want a better roll. I feel like it's not value. You've got plus two on defense as well, though. We'll take attack, health, and then we might have to take one of these plus twos. So I guess we'll take defense. Uh, I don't know. Resolve's pretty bad. We'll take defense. Okay, right. We didn't lose anybody. It was very spooky. We've got a contract to do. There's nothing for us to do in the town. Are we... We need to kind of heal up for a day anyway. Wait, is there a temple? There is a temple. Let's wait till morning. It's been an hour. We need to end the episode. <laughs> we'll just wait till morning, okay? We'll camp out. We'll heal up. Helps if you unpause. Uh... Oh. Gernot asks you to enter, the, enter Misty the Warhound into a local dog fighting circle that sounds like an awful idea but the man goes on to explain that a lot of money stands to be made in dog fighting all the dog handler needs an ante of 200 crowns we are not putting our dogs i know we're using them to fight but we're not putting them in commercial dog fighting okay we're not doing it right morning is upon us temple shall we pay 140 to heal it now no because he is an archer Minus 35% hit points is bad, but I'm kind of just hopeful we're going to get away with it. Do we need anything? Tools would be good, but they are disgustingly expensive. Certainly don't need paint. Food. We've got four days worth. We are starting to run out. The food is about at market value. We'll probably buy a bit of bread. Just to give it an extra day. Medical supplies. We've got 26. It's not terrible. 
So no, I don't think we need anything. I think we can go and do the contract. Um, follow the tracks and, and get that done. However, so yeah, follow these tracks. It has been an hour, a very quick hour, at least for me. Hopefully you're enjoying it as well. So I'm going to draw it to a close there. Um, we're still going pretty strong, actually, aren't we? We're, we're not, we're not, we've lost a few people, but we've, we've come back. We're okay. And uh, yeah, it's, it's going well. I'm actually, actually loving it so far. It's really good. So thank you for joining me, as always. Have an awesome day, wherever you are. And I'll see you next time.